We are almost there at the shelter. So, looking forward to getting Bobby out in the farm today. Hopefully he's excited. I hear that he's full of energy, needs a good run. So we'll see how he goes. Here we go. Let's go get him. <laughs> so we got Bobby here. Hi mate. Hi buddy. Hi buddy, good boy. Good boy, come on. Come on mate. Hello mate. Hello Bobby. Hello Bobby. Oh hi. Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. Oh. Almost there buddy. Hey. Almost there buddy. Almost there. What do you think? Where are we? What are we doing? Hey? What do you think mate? Where are we Bobby? We're going to the farm? We're going to the farm? <laughs> hey, he's a bit nervous aren't you mate, hey? Not sure what's going on? Not sure what's going on buddy? Right, hey, we've just arrived. Bobby's in the bus. And Bobby looks like he is going to run all day. Hopefully we can burn some of that energy. Because he looks like he's got a lot in the tank. G'day guys, we've got Bobby today. He's a little bit nervous at these ramps, had to carry him in. Oh, hi Bobby. There he goes, good boy, mate. Good boy. Bobby, Bobby, come say hello to Sam. Hi. Hello, hi. darling. Hello, hi. sweetie. Hi, oh, oh, hello. Yeah, hello. Aww. Come on, mate. Come on, buddy. Good boy. He's got nice markings, doesn't he? Look at he his legs. He wants to run. Mate, there's a dam up there. You ready, buddy? You ready? Ready to go? Sit him free. Go. go! Let's go, mate. Bobby! Go, mate. Good boy! Good boy! He might be keen on oh hello yeah. hello mate oh good boy hello hello <laughs> hi mate hi mate oh, you're boy, an affectionate Bobby. boy aren't you <laughs> hello it's like he needs to put himself <laughs> right in the right in the middle don't you mate hey hello mate yeah <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hello, mate. Hello, bro. Oh, buddy. Hi. Hi, mate. Hello. Hello. Hello, mate. Oh. He's loving the sands. <laughs> Hello, mate. Oh. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> Ready, 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 go. Hello, mate. You don't know what to do, do you? Hey, eh? you don't know what to do. Good boy. Good boy. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Good boy. Good boy. Hello, 
Don't chase this big ball. Come on, mate. Let's chase this big ball. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, thank you. Thank you. Thanks, mate. Thanks, mate. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. He's got those back legs nice and straight, doesn't he? Okay, mate. Look at your muscles, huh? Look at your muscles. Oh, good boy, mate. Okay, free. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Hello. 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 Good boy, mate. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Yummy. 
Hey guys, so this is Bobby. <laughs> Hello, mate. Hi, Bobby. Bobby wants to just be pat. He wants to be held. He wants to be touching you. As you can see, he is very, very affectionate. And uh, unfortunately for Bobby, he's actually would be uh, misinterpreted very often. And what I mean by that is. As you can see, he's got his ridge down his back. So it's difficult to, or harder to tell if his hackles are standing up. He doesn't have a tail, so you can't tell if it's wagging. Uh, so a lot of people would find it very difficult to interpret his, uh, his personality. And I feel for him because he's got a really, really sweet personality. He, um, he's very innocent. He's a, he's a dog that, um, you know, you could quickly categorize in one incorrect category. Um, but in reality, he shows signs of nervousness because he's got a bit of self-doubt. 
you know, he, he's not confident within himself, within his own ability. So, um, and he is very powerful, very fast. So he springs to life and launches, but he's not sure that, um, what he can actually do. Hey, mate. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy boy. So, you know, for a dog that is just so loving and just wants your affection, just wants your pats. Like, look at this. He's been doing this to me all day. He, just one pat isn't enough. <laughs> Hello, mate. We've just had a bath and he's rolling around in the dirt. Righto. Righto, mate. But, you know, this is, this is what he wants to do. He's just... He's just such an affectionate dog. Um, and to look at him, like I said, a lot of people just wouldn't see that at first impressions. A lot of people would um, categorize him differently and which would be incorrect. He, he's not once barked, not once growled. He's, um, you know, just shown an eagerness, but also a nervousness at the same time. But the nervousness isn't around anything other than self-doubt. Like I said, he's got a, got a bit of a confidence issue within himself, which isn't a bad thing. It's, it comes out in all the good ways. It's not a negative thing. Like some dogs who are uh, nervous or not confident, they might be reactive as a, as a consequence. This is definitely not him. Um, he, he's, he doesn't come out in anything uh, negative. I'm just reading that in his uh, interactions that I've had with him today. Um, you know, but once he gets comfortable, he's really just give me more, touch me, you know, let me lie on you, let me, uh, let me be with you anywhere you are, whatever you're doing, you know, this is it. We're walking through the bush, there's no lead, there's about 25 acres of bushland here. Look where he is, okay. sitting on me. So it, it just goes to show, you know, don't judge a book by its cover. Looks can be deceiving. What you've got here is a young puppy who once built a relationship will be a very rewarding dog. Um, you know, he's, he's quite strong and, um, and quite fit. So he does need a little bit of exercise, uh, but you know, he had a bit of a run today and then went and lay down in the shade, didn't you mate? Hey? So it's not like he's super fit. It's not like he's on a, on a level of a Kelpie or a working dog. Um, but yeah, like I said, any any of those little stuff like the manners and, and that kind of stuff we can fix really easily. So if you want to adopt him, um, contact Central Coast Animal Care Facility. We'll get in touch straight away and uh, organize training here. Uh, we'll get those basics down pat, get your connection going and you know, he, he is going to be a really rewarding dog for someone that wants to have the best of both worlds. A dog that's going to run around and, um, you know, play with other dogs. And then also a dog that on a rainy day will just be so content sitting on the couch next to you and uh, just absorbing all this love and affection. And affection. So really, really cool. But uh, I do feel for him because... I know that a lot of people would just take one look at him and go, you know, I can't read that dog. It, 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 I'm not comfortable with uh, the signals that he's giving. And it's purely because all those basic ones, like, like the ridge and no tail, um, those signs aren't there. So you can't read them or they're a lot harder to read. But you're an absolute sweetie, aren't you, mate? Hey? What a good boy.